Southampton piled more misery on an Everton side totally in disarray as they hammered them 41 at St. Mary's in the Premier League. The Toffees have now shipped nine goals in two matches as they continue to struggle for form under caretaker boss David Unsworth, as they became the worst defence in the league with 27 goals conceded this term. Serbian Dusan Tadic had put the Saints ahead early doors when the defence was split by a Ryan Bertrand ball into the box, with the striker getting the ball out from under his feet to hit the back of the net, firing from just inside the area. Everton went to half-time level, however, with Jiffy Sigurdsson letting fly with a wonder strike from the edge of the area that found the net after ricocheting off the crossbar, left post and then in, in what was Everton's first shot on target. The second half was all Southampton. Charlie Austin bagged a brace the first player to do so this season with headed goals only. The icing on the cake came when Stephen Davis finished from the top of the box on 87 minutes. The win pushes Southampton up to 10th in the table, with Everton languishing in 16th. Speaking post-match, Braceman Austin praised the result over his own performance in a superb victory. I'm pleased with the goals, but we needed that in front of our own fans and it puts us into the top half. For me, it was about biding my time, working hard on the training pitch and the important thing was getting the three points today. There was further bad news for Everton post-match as Unsworth confirmed injuries for Leighton Baines and Michael Keane. Baines left the field after just 27 minutes with a calf injury, while Keane also left the field with 15 minutes to go in the tie. Leighton has done his calf unfortunately. Well probably assess him more tomorrow, said Unsworth. He said he felt his calf pop which is never a good sign, a muscle injury like that so early in the game. Well reassess him but he looks like he'll be struggling for Wednesday against West Ham live on BT Sport. Michael Keane was a bit different. I don't know whether it was concussion. I've not spoken to Michael or the doctor. He was with the doctor in the changing rooms at the end of the game and I haven't had chance to speak to either yet. You can all of Everton's Europa League campaign on the IR Sport package, David Unsworth side face Leon, Atalanta and Apollon Limassol in Group E. Everton face Apollon Limassol at the Syrian Stadium on 7 December, a match which will be shown live on the IR Sport Pack kickoff 6 p.m. Everton take on West Ham in the Premier League on Wednesday 29 November, a match which will be shown live on BT Sport 1 on the IR Sport Pack kickoff 8 p.m. Image Getty Richard Hethcott IR Sport channels are available across the IR Vision, Sky and Vodafone TV platforms as well as on the IR Sport app. All seven channels in the IR Sport Pack are available for free if you are a residential IR broadband customer.